guys, I'm Olga. And I'm Anze. And that's the 11th episode of ABG TV show. And just like every week we started with the question, and this week it was, what would be your first wish if you caught a goldfish? Um, get a really good job. A better AUBG. World peace. I'm gonna wish for... Peace. For a thousand more. True love. Zero AOBG tax. Find a black skinned dude with a big, big mustache. Uh, I don't know, help? Uh, it's not gonna come true if I'm gonna say. <laughs> not to find myself somewhere on the island. Bigger penis. Free dinner at Casa Adria. The president of ABG, David Hewweiler, is retiring. If you wanna find out more about it, watch the next video. I was expecting great things and I haven't been disappointed. I was, I was very excited about the opportunity to come here because, um, as I said, I knew about ABG. I had always admired ABG. I had spent some time on campus and uh, given my own background, my interests and my experience, it seemed like a great match and I wasn't disappointed. This has been, uh, it's been a, a terrific six years from my point of view. Why did you decide to retire then? Well, part of it is just I'm getting to that age. Uh, when I came in 2007, the board asked me how long I planned to stay, and I told them six years. I said I would probably do two, three-year contracts. So this isn't really a surprise to them. Um, it's, it's been in the plan. I will confess that there have been moments when I, I thought about extending because uh, it, it, it's a wonderful job. I've told the board, I think this is the best job in the world. I'm sure I will do something in international education, but I'm pretty sure it won't be another presidency. They're pretty intense, and after 13 years, it's probably time to do something a little bit different. Maybe you've heard that this year's ABG musical called Greece, we're traveling around Bulgaria on their tour, and in the next video, you can see some behind the scenes of how it went. By the seashore. She sells seashells 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 by the seashore. This was a sneak peek from behind the scenes of Grease the Musical. The cast members were preparing before their last show in Bath for AOBG TV Maria Marinova. By the way, we have an engineering club in ABG and they have made a robot. In the next video, you can see what it looks like. Uh, we got the funding from SG and uh, then the first meeting was on March 17th. But the robot is mostly about the uh, mechanical part. Uh, I mean, it's, it's, it's called engineering club, but to be honest with you, it's mostly amateur engineering club because we don't do that much calculations or like 3D programming, we just do improvisation and we do that. I mean, it's, it's nothing really complicated, it's just, um, yeah, in fact, it's a lot of fun. This semester we're gonna do a lot of the programming together with it because we need to make it more sophisticated to en enable the sensors and to do all those things. But uh, also I hope that we're gonna get some additional funding and we're gonna contact some sponsors. Maybe SD gonna give more money. Starting from next academic year, student government is going to have a new president. The student representative won by four votes. And uh, this means that four people changed the discourse of the year. What I'd like to say is uh, that it's important for people to vote. If you want something to change, you have to voice out your opinion. You have to speak. No one else is going to do it for you if you don't insist on it. As a campaign, as a whole team of the officers, we'll try, um, team as a president and me as a vice president, we'll try to encourage people to communicate their needs and their, and their wishes to us because we're the, the mediator, we're the wall, the bouncing wall between the staff and faculty and the students and we're trying to negotiate the best possible um, conditions for both sides 
and um, we'll try to favor more the students as it should be. I guess this will encourage them to to participate and be more active in the AUBG life. Clifford Christians, and last Thursday he held his first guest lecture in AUBG. On April 18, Balkanski Panica Institute for Advanced Study presented its guest speaker Clifford Christians, a research professor of communications at the University of Illinois. He held a lecture on the truth in the global media age and spoke about several major media actors on the worldwide arena. In example one, international satellite news, Al Jazeera, the Arab news network founded in Qatar in 1996. Al Jazeera receives status and prominence during the Iraq war. Kevin Carter grew up in Johannesburg, South Africa. He made what some have called the best technical photo ever published. What I liked most about the lecture was the examples um, Professor showed us about Al Jazeera channel, um, about a photographer uh, who shot a starving child in Uganda. Last Wednesday, teams Black Eagles and Wicked Seek played in a football competition for the final of the league. Let's see who the winner was. On the 18th of April was held the LBG Soccer Championship Final. The teams of Wicked Seek and Black Eagles played against each other in front of the audience who came to support them in Peer and Sports Hall. Even though the team of Wicked Seek was ahead in the score almost until the end of the game, Black Eagles managed to win the game with a score of 2-3 and became the new LBG champions. We have to play in Olympics, we have a cup, so we are looking forward to, to this tournament and then we will see what's going to happen next year. It's awesome, we, we scored two late goals, so you know. There are no words to describe this feeling right now. That's the other country. Last Wednesday, there was an Easter concert in AUBG where students from Harp class showed what they've learned. I was nervous, really. And before the play, I was going out all the time, like just doing nothing. I didn't know, trying to calm myself down. And all the time, I was thinking about my girlfriend. She's, she's away from here. That's why. Thinking about her helps me to be calmed down and do it, you know, in a nicer way. I'm really thankful to ABG that uh, it has this course, otherwise I wouldn't even start playing piano. This Saturday, Contemporary and Jazz Ballet Club held a performance together with Big Band Blagojevgrad in Peja Yavorov Hall. Maybe somewhere by the middle of semester we started preparing choreographies specifically and we determined which exactly how it's, we found out more about the concept of the concert. But we practiced, we worked hard even before it. All choreographies except one are done by me and, uh, but I can't say that it's just my vision. It's all uh, together, together's work, so it's our contribution, it's our product. And we paid a lot of attention on contact improvisation and that's, that's going to be visible even tonight because we, we like to leave, um, we like to leave to choreography to be product of the moment, how we feel it, and that's what it's innovative and uh, catchy. That's all for this week. You're still welcome to join our Facebook group and follow our blog and Twitter. And see you next week.